Got our wheel of pain, so we're in good shape now. Those guys were chasing us. So the, the trick to this uh, I have found is I have to keep... Okay, so we got a couple of people that are ready. Uh, looks like an archer's ready. And that fighter. So we got... Uh, Delencia, the snow hunter, and we got Work of the Lost Tribe. He's an armor. Really want those two out of there because, obviously, because they're named. Uh, let's put... That throw... Oh, wait a minute. Is she ready? She is ready. Nice. I need to get another truncheon for her. Alright, so we're going to put these guys in here. And then we're going to move the tiger to guard. But this is the trick. You have to... There's my panther. You have to keep these guys off to the side. And then you can walk over here if you need them. But you have to kind of place them where they won't kill the different things that you're that you're trying to. Cause so, like, if I bring out, it, in other words, I'm gonna. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna draw these guys out, and I'll draw them over here to this side. So and and so he'll see them and help me knock them out. But I have to keep them on this side over here because I don't want the animals to attack them. In fact, I'm going to go move these guys out a little bit further. You don't want these animals to to attack and kill the uh, thralls that you're trying to get. That's why I have them... I don't know. I think it's the actual proximity. I don't think it has to do with what direction they're looking in. But uh, I do place them out like this just to kind of just because so we'll place those out like that I'll go ahead and get my sword, my sword drawn and um, what I'll do is I'll lead these thralls out here to him alright let me look and see what we got here I've got room for three in the wheel of pain okay so level threes and above is what we're gonna get. Doesn't matter what they are necessarily, but that that's what we're gonna that's what we're after. So we'll you know, we'll try to pull this fighter out. These guys are pretty tough. Um, I'm told the further north we go, the the tougher these guys are and they are pretty tough you have to kind of vary your swings and your attacks with them and those things are over there attacking those baddies are over there attacking this dude alright let's see who is this guy he's a fighter too so we're going to go ahead and kill him. He'll get a few shots in on us. Here and there, and then we'll heal up. We'll keep moving through. We've got a, um archer that's hitting us. Oh, shoot. Yeah. Where the heck did he come from? Yeah, we're going to get corruption from him. And that's not good. So here's what we're going to do. Since we have this going on. I'll just lure him over here to his death.
Because these things are pretty tough. You can see I'm getting corrupted from him. So, whoops, 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 don't do that. That corruption's not any good. You have to go um, to one of your dancers and um, get that taken off. You'll see it'll only heal up to a certain point. So now it's brought down my max health and my max uh, stam down a little bit. So I'll have to go to one of my entertainers to, to get that fixed. And here she is. She's a level one archer, so... We don't care anything about a level one. That's pretty nasty. As I recall, this was a, a good thrall right here. It's an armor or two. Which I can't use. Yikes. She gone. All right, this guy's getting on my nerves. All right, I'm going to go around this way. It seems like there was a pretty good thrall or two over here. So we're going to go this way and see if we can't. We're looking for level threes. Friend or foe, stand and be seen. Armor one. Fighter two. This will be a pretty tough fight right here. These guys will get shots in on me, so you have to keep... What I'm doing is I'm burying up my attack. Uh, that seems to work, I don't know. It seems to work for me, anyway. Um... I hit them with, um... Let's see... It seems like I got a pretty good thrall here. It's a Carpenter 1. But, um, it seems like when I hit them with these quick attacks and then follow it up, it's, that seems to work pretty good. I would really love to get a Berserker. I think that's... Whoa, 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 whoa. And this guy will do a backflip on me here in a minute. Most likely. Nope. Let me see if this is the Berserker down here. It sounds like it. Yep, that's him. Let's knock him out. He's pretty tough. So, he'll be hard to get. Now he's a fighter, so he'll be... Again, that'll give us uh, two named fighters out of this outfit. And uh, that'll give me four named fighters, which is really good because that's what I want to take over there to try to help me uh, kill that, um, kill that legendary. I was looking for this guy before, so let's get him back to our spot. Actually, I think I just went the wrong way. I did. Um. I'll take him over there to the um, to help me kill that rock branch. So he's one. I'm okay. There's two, and I've got plenty of food in there. 
Shouldn't have any issues on food. All right, let's see now. Archers, fighters, any of that stuff will help. Kind of snuck around here a little bit. I wonder what this guy is right here. I found a couple of good archers right here. He's a fighter three. We can use him. Yeah, see, they're pretty tough. If you can ever get in a rhythm, then I'm up on I'm up on the wrong kind of ground here. If I could move, it would help. Does that every once in a while? It's like it freezes. It's like it's almost like you're walking in mud. This guy's whipping my butt. Got him. All right, let me see if I can heal up a little bit now. That was pretty, pretty intense. So we'll pick up. We'll pick him up. Take him back out of here. Each time I come over here, I'm a little bit more efficient at what I'm doing. And I haven't brought a guy out because I, I it just seems like I'm having better luck. So I haven't brought a guy out yet. Okay, so now we have this Berserker level 3 fighter and this um, armor named armor that named armor is really going to be a shot in the arm if i can get a um archer out of this that would be awesome all right let me go let's go down let's go down this direction because there's some water down here i can replenish my water without getting into my juice just something that i want to do that berserker, if you're looking for him, is usually around the outside of the city. Usually, he's hanging out around this wa around these water coves. So that would be my suggestion if you're trying to get him. Let's see what these guys are about. One of them is gonna have to go. It's a fighter, archer. Not real happy with those guys. Let's take these guys out. He's out of there. Let's see what this is. This is a, another archer. So there's several of them. See, they're relentless. See, now, now, see, they've suckered me into coming up here. And now there's three of them. So what you have to do is try to maneuver your way around them. Kind of divide and conquer. See, this weapon's glowing. I, I'm told that this is a star metal weapon. Which is why they they hit a ton. Another thing I found with these guys is that when you um, when they have a shield, uh, the the quick strikes are better. All right, now finish her off. see what she has arrows we can use those Let's see what this guy's got on him i am looting a little bit more than i had been all right let's see what this guy's about so i need an archer three would be helpful he's an archer one Oh, that was a slice to the face. To the face. Oh, 
I'll try to heal up a little bit. And my character's a level 60, so it's got this passive regen. And so that's why you'll see me regening without eating. So that's another thing. Whoa. Level 3 fighter. Let me go around this guy and see what this... What these guys are over here. Smelter. I do need a level 3 smelter. I need a level 3 blacksmith as well. It's a level 2 archer. So let's... Let's see if we can draw this guy out. This fighter right here. And I'll show you what I'm talking about. Hey, Crip Girl. Shuman, if you're there, could you shout Crip Girl out if uh, if you can? I think I went the wrong way here. Yeah, let's get this guy to follow us. They're taking shots at me. Yeah, he's still chasing me. Crip Girl, I'll get you a shout out in just a minute. How are you doing today? So see now he'll engage this fighter. We'll actually both engage him. And they'll be out. Thank you, Schumann. Pretty tired, probably going to crash in a few minutes. Okay, cool. Well, I mean, cool that you're going to get to crash, not, cute, not cool that you're pretty tired. Although tired can be a good thing, you know what I mean? Thank you so much, dude. Thank you, Schumann. <laughs> Thanks, man. I appreciate it, brother. That's awesome of you, man. Thank you so much. It's so much easier when you have somebody that can do that. Guys, there is the link to Crip Girl. I hope that you guys will click that and go give her a follow. Clip Crip Girl, I thought you were pretty close. You're pretty close to 500, Crip Girl. You've got like 52 more left. So that's getting pretty close, which is cool. All right, so here's the situation. We have... Four in this Wheel of Pain. Three fighters. And an armor. Uh, we picked up some pretty good loot that we're going to take back.